Uh, welcome, welcome back. We're here. We're gonna play some Dragon Age today. Let me just uh, work some stuff real quick with chat. Get rid of this. All right, we're gonna play some Dragon Age. One of my playthroughs. We're gonna start the first one today. And we're gonna play this every Tuesday until I'm done with Dragon Age One and Two. All right. I don't know how it sounds. Let's see if it's too loud. We're gonna start the first one today. And we're gonna play this every Tuesday until I'm done with Dragon Age One and Two. All right. I don't know how it sounds. Let's see if it's too loud. I'm gonna turn it up a little bit, I guess. We'll see how it goes. There we go. All right, let's start. Uh, we're gonna play Origins first, cause that's the one I'm playing. I want to be quiet during the cutscenes, by the way. There aren't many in this game, so... Watch. The Chantry teaches us that it is the hubris of men which brought the Darkspawn into our world. The mages had sought to usurp heaven, but instead, they destroyed it. were cast out, twisted and cursed by their own corruption. They returned as monsters, the first of the Darks. They became a blight upon the lands, unstoppable and relentless. Dwarven kingdoms were the first to fall, and from the deep roads, the dark spawn drove at us again and again until finally we neared annihilation. from every race, warriors and mages, barbarians and kings. The Grey Warden sacrificed everything to stem the tide of darkness and prevail. Four centuries since that victory, and we have kept our vigil. We have watched and waited for the Dark Spawn to return. But those who once called us heroes have forgotten. We are few now, and our warnings have been ignored for too long. Hello, Omen. How's it going, man? So I plan on doing three playthroughs of this, by the way, guys. Uh, this is the first of three. I've already decided I want to start with my female ranger. Um, so she's going to be uh, a rogue. And I... 
I think I want to do a Dalish Elf. Yeah, we're going to do a Dalish Elf. And I'm going to set it all up myself because, you know, you play a character enough, you, you at least want to like what they look like. Not do something stupid. Especially when you really love the game, which I do. You know what? Let's go for a, a Queen Chappie look, uh, if that's possible. There we go. We'll even name her Rose. Because that's what I do. Alright. By the way, there is no webcam for this just because there's no point for one. My wife had a tattoo and she was an elf. What would it look like? Something I can't answer myself. But she's not here to ask. I'd say something like that. Let's go with this one. There we go. Let's go to the her. I'm pretty sure you can't do extremely long hair in this. Nope. Oh, we'll do bald. No, I'm kidding. We're not doing bald. Get that Liliana hairstyle going. Because Liliana is the best thing ever. I think we'll go with this. Webcam or riot? I, I really don't want to do a webcam for this. I'll be honest. I don't see a point to one. It's an RPG. It's going to take forever to finish. Maybe I'll add it later, but today there's no webcam. Oh, damn bushy eyebrows. No, I'm kidding. She's actually, my wife has extremely thin eyebrows. They're even thinner than that. Are those the only three options? That is. And they're extremely light. I guess that'll do. Now, one of the most adorable things about the queen, she has extremely wide, bright eyes with a slight slant. That'll have to do. It just looks like she's crazy and cross-eyed. There we go. And they're blue. Of course, you can't really see for some reason. Okay. We'll skip mouth and nose because that stuff just takes too long. Portrait. There we go. My wife is a very mystical person. Next! Oh, poor. 
Poor guy, Omen. I'm sorry. Um, we'll put one into cunning, two into dexterity, one into strength, and another one into dexterity. Because I can. And... We'll start you with that. Gotta have that lock picking. Oh wait, I don't want to start her with that. I need to start her with combat training. So we can start archery and one lock picking. Bam! And we'll do normal difficulty because I've played the game on fully hard difficulty. I'll be the first person to tell you this is probably one of the hardest games to beat. You were born amidst the Danish elves. Noble like that. Who refused to join the society of humans that subjugated their homeland so long ago. Dalish traveled the land in tightly knit clans, struggling to maintain their half-forgotten law in a human world that fears and despises them. You spend your time hunting with your clanmate, Tamlin, in the forests. And as is sometimes the case, your quarry is not always the local wildlife. Get right, kid. It's a Dalish! And you three are somewhere you shouldn't be. Let us pass, El. You have no right to stop us. No? We'll see about that, both. You're yeah. just in time. I found these humans lurking in the bushes. Bandits, no doubt. We aren't bandits, I swear. Please don't hurt us. I'm gonna go for a nice person. Shemlin, a pathetic. It's hard to believe. With this character. Because that's just like the wife. We've never done nothing to you, Dalish. We didn't even know this forest was yours. This forest isn't ours, fool. You've stumbled too close to our camp. You shems are like birds. I can't trust you not to make mischief. What do you say, Lenderoo? What should we do? Um... Let's find out what they're doing here. Does it matter? Hunting or banditry, we'll need to move camp if we let them live. Look, we didn't come here to be trouble. We just found a cave. Yes, a cave with ruins like I've never seen. We thought there might be uh... treasure. So you're more akin to thieves than actual bandits. Uh, the wife is an adventurous person. She would love to see a cave. So would I. I've never heard of ruins in these parts. But I, uh, I have proof. Here, we found this just inside the entrance. This stone has carvings. Is this elvish? Written elvish? There's, there's more in the ruins. We didn't get very far in, though. I bet you didn't, pussy. There was a demon. It was huge with black eyes. Thank the maker we were able to outrun it. A demon. Where is this cave? Just off the west, I think. There's a cave in the rock face and a huge hole just inside. Well, do you trust them? Should we let them go? Oh, I don't see a reason to kill them, to be honest. I mean, if I was playing this my way, I'd kill them all. No. Um, but I'll let them live. Don't come back until we Dalish have moved on. Of course. Thank you. Thank you. Well, shall we see if there's any truth to this story? Yes. Let's go look. Yes, he will. Tactical overview. The game can play from a variety of tactical viewpoints. Use the mouse wheel to bring your camera down to explore mode. Scroll forward. Scroll out. Scroll forward. While pause, you can issue orders. Right click on your destination. Your car just gonna move. Uh, press space button. Basically, tactical mode. Something. All right. One moment.
Yeah, I would murder everyone. As, you know, said before, you've got tactical mode, something that everyone loves who plays Dragon Age. Um, for me, it just depends on my mood that day. But honestly, I quite like it too. There we go. My mouse sensitivity was a bit high. Turned it down though. Let's go explore this cave. Uh, to equip new items, you'll need to open the interview screen. The interview. The inventory screen. Do so by clicking I. So I equip dragon item. I really don't need to go over all this. Uh, put them in my quick bar. Okay. Paused. Oh, that's right. It's gonna pause until I tell it not to. Alright, hold on. For some reason, I accidentally clicked on him. That sounds a bit loud. All right, hold on. For some reason, I accidentally clicked on him. That sounds a bit loud. Oh, it'll be fine. People can control. All right, get shit on, Wolf. Time to move on. Cave was, yeah, I'm, tr I'm trying not to make really bad jokes about caves, but it's tempting and I might. Alright, let me move away. Yeah, he got shit on, but that's just gonna happen a lot. Achievement. I'm a lock picker. I don't really know what that means, but it's what I am. Okay. Is it E for these? Is it not F? I don't remember what the button, the quick button is for those. Thought it was F. So then Dr. Josh says Grace. Yep, I don't know what it is, but it's not what I thought it was. Loot! What is the button to take everything? Oh well. <laughs> Fuck me then, right? This must be the cave. I don't recall seeing this before, do you? My thoughts exactly. With luck, we'll find something that will make us clan heroes. Yes, I want to be a hero. Make me a hero, cave! Giggity. Hey, I plan on playing Dark Souls on Friday. Dark, uh, Friday is Dark Souls Day. But anyways, back to Dragon Age. The better of the two games. That is a little loud. I'll be honest. Let's turn it down a bit. There we go. I wish I had a better bow and some abilities, because right now this is really boring. Okay, let's check. It's not F. Let me go into options real quick. I can't... It's been like six months since I've played the game. Actually, it's been a while less. I'm lying to you. Uh... Huh. Did I miss it? Oh well. Fuck it. Don't care. I stopped caring. It's, uh, 
Let's move on with my day. So save it. exactly. All right. Yay, corpses. Do 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 do. Ah, actually, to be honest, I haven't really played through the Dalish Elf one in forever. You know, I wanted to get rid of that trap. Please, please. Thank you. One moment. That's right, it's a passive. Okay. Pick up everything! Get rid of that trap, by the way. You can do that, right? Good girl. Nothing else in here, but you know the way you play RPGs, you got you got to explore everything. And I kind of just walked over that trap, not caring. Yeah, that was a problem. Will you? Hold on. Let me go over to his ass right now. Aggressive, please. You're a tank. Like, do your job, dude. Yeah, get fucking straddled. Look at that. Do your job. Getting straddled by a fucking... What's wrong with you, dude? Getting fucking straddled by, by a spider. Someone might have a couple issues that he doesn't want to talk about. Thank you. What is that? Yeah, that would take a while. It is some kind of trap. But Chappie loves himself Dragon Age. It's honestly my favorite uh, console. When I did only have consoles, it was my favorite console game. But in general, it's one of my favorite games of all time. The whole series, really. It's pretty good. A lot of people didn't like Dragon Age 2. No, it wasn't the best thing ever made, but it wasn't terrible. So. Yeah, that's Dark Spawn, isn't it? No, it's just skeletons. Nope. What is it? It's possible. Uh, let's go with it's interesting. So much of our past has been lost. You know what? Shit like that could have happened, bro. Bra. Can I? Thank you. Well, are you gonna? All right, all right. Here. There you 
go. He should be fine now. What do you think you're doing, girl? Hold on. This bitch is tripping if she thinks she's using that. You're a ranger. Start using the proper material. Yeah, yeah, place is haunted. Get over it, bitch. Don't be a cock muncher. Alright, what could possibly... Oh, boy. No, 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 no. Attack him. Let me just sit back here and throw arrows at you constantly. What is with him and being straddled by shit? Oh, you just got fucked. All right. Only because he can straddle me. Okay. Thankfully, leveling up. Every time you gain a your level, your character gains new abilities and improves statistics. Left click on the button next to your name. Blah, blah, blah. Alright, we'll put another two points into dexterity. And for now, we'll put another one into strength. Next. Ah, uh, good question. I think we'll go with survival. And we'll, uh... We'll pick up Pitting Shot. And we're gonna move this. God damn it. Uh, if you're so eager to look at it, go ahead. I know what it is. Don't get too close, bro. Mm -mm, mm 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 Don't do it. No, no, don't, no. Don't. Don't be dumb. Don't. I bet there's a great blackness. Big blackness for you getting straddled. Bye. You should be more careful. Dumbass. Can you hear me? Yep. Hello, Duncan. How are you? Uh, get shit on, son. That's what happens when you don't listen. Oh, the Dalish! You're awake. Give the gods own luck, my lord. You're back at camp. I was worried sick about you. Uh. Dun, dun, dun. Relatively possible. Sounds like any other Friday night. Never mind, you're old. Go away. I know not what darkened you, but it nearly bled the life from you. It was difficult even for my magic to keep you alive. Yes, he introduced himself as 
the Grey Warden. Duncan thought there may have been darkspawn creatures inside the cave. Is that true? Uh. They were walking corpses, but there was no darkspawn. Big ass mirror. And it caused all this. I have never heard of such a thing in all the lore we have collected. Oh, I was hoping for answers when you woke. But there are only more questions. That's what happens when you talk to a woman. He is more important than any lore in these rooms. If he is as sick as you were, his condition is grave. Duncan returned to the cave to search for Darkspawn. We cannot rely on him to look for Townman as well. We must go ourselves, and quickly. Do you feel well enough to show us the way, Diamond? Without you, we will not find it. I am relieved to hear it. Sure, I'll show you, bitch. I am ordering the clan to pack the camp so we can go north. Take Meryl with you to the cave. Find Tamlin if you can, but do it swiftly. Quickly, the Talman's life hangs in the balance. Meryl! Is that, is that Meryl? I think it is. Is that my girl, Meryl? Okay. Hello, everybody! Go with us. I'll follow you. Just to make sure Meryl doesn't go running to the keeper when you tell her I'm coming. Oh yeah, you'll be coming, alright. Don't you worry about that. A chesty chest. Open. You Fuck you. Take everything. Leave nothing. Also, get stuck on a hundred things. Oh, let's let's go. Uh... Okay. Do 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 do. Ooh, hello. I'm glad you've recovered. Once we find Tam, we can concentrate on the journey. Thank you for the bow, Master Island. It is light and sturdy, much better than the one I made last year. You are more than welcome. My father made it and used it in battle against the Clan tribes. I will carry it with honor. One of my own crafting, perhaps? It may not have a history. You'll provide one for it soon enough. Oh, yeah. Shove it straight up someone's ass. Uh. Of course. I don't want to hear about your father's battles. What do you got for me, bruh? Really, he's got nothing. And I don't have money. I'm lying. I don't want to talk to you. Your bow, though. It's. The same fucking thing. Oh, yeah. You're an asshole. Oh, a chest. I will open it and take whatever is inside. Thank you. You have a name. Who are you? That smile's creepy. He's missing, that's all we know. Fleshlings. Mother and father, may they rest in peace. 
Police would be horrified to see you take such risks. What happened then is a sad tale, but it's in the past. The opening old wounds benefits no one. You have much to do tonight, but Tamlin's still missing. I will tell you another time. No, you won't, bitch. I gotta get my sweet talk up. Probably should have done that from the beginning. But the wife isn't much of a sweet talker to begin with. Now, is this the Meryl? I think it is. Oh, <gasps> I totally didn't realize she was in this game. That's Meryl from Dragon Age 2. Meryl, baby. The keeper told me I'm to accompany you back to those caves. As your apprentice, I may see something you missed. But our main objective is to find Tamlin, of course. We must make haste. He may not have much time. Oh, about him. About this. Shut your whore mouth, Meryl. My persuasion isn't high enough. At all. I should have been working on that. Oh well. I don't always get what you want. Turn chat. Oh my god. Curse you, Elman. Bring Farrell. Are you certain? I'm already putting Meryl at risk. I don't want to lose you too. I want to help Keeper. If we can find Tamlin, it's worth the risk. Very well. Then. You have my permission. And thank you for Yeah, well, fuck you. I didn't want to ask. I was forced to by your pet, Meryl. Who I'm pretty sure is Meryl from Dragon Age 2. Yes. Oh my God, you can't. I notice him. We asked. The keeper has given her leave. Let us make haste while daylight lasts. Yeah, bitch. Let's go. We got places to be. It looks like a. What? What already spawned? Oh, that that dark spawn. We do not have a tank with us. That's right. Our tank is lost somewhere. What were those things? Were those dark spots? They look like it. I've never seen anything like them. You can smell the evil on them. Yeah. Where did they come from? Were they here before? What would dark spawn have to do with our people? The stories say our Latin fell long before the dark spawn appeared. Well, we'll find out soon enough. Let's hope we don't find any more of these. Oh, we will. Like 90. Are you alright? Were you hurt during the fight? Kiss me. You look quite pale now that Meryl's mentioned. I've always been pale. Nothing. Forget I said anything. Let's go. Have you met my wife, Queen Chappie? She's like whiter than marble. It's ridiculous, but adorable. Let's move on. Couldn't give a tan if she burned herself on the sun. It's ridiculous. I wonder whose camp this is. Do you remember it being here? No. Grey Warden said he was returning to the cave. Perhaps this is his camp. If so, he's not here now. I've seen no sign of Tony. Maybe we should. Wait. Do you hear that? Huh. It seems whatever you woke up inside that cave has spread outside. The sooner we find this cave and Tamlin, the sooner we can leave. Take us there quickly. 
But mom, you don't sound like Meryl that I know. Maybe it's not the same Meryl. Because the Meryl I remember wasn't a fucking bitch. Give me that. Give me that. Okay. Moving on up. <laughs> We're almost there, peons. There we are. And in we go. Yes, my friend. I didn't notice that before. As you said. Give me everything in your sack. So those are dark spawn. So, dead spider, and then a bunch of dead, uh, dark spawn. Well, left or right? Well, we went left first last time. Let's go right. Yeah, that's why they're called dark spawn. And they're called that for a reason. Well, for those of the people in the world who have met Queen, she's extremely pale. Stupid fucking trap. Get him. Get him. I will make this Die, damn you. Ow. Pop culture has changed them. Oh god, I'm gonna ignore that statement, Omen. Because of how fucking bad it is. Why are you telling me insufficient skill? I will fucking destroy you. Walked right into that, didn't I? Literally. Now my foot is stuck. Now there's dark spawn. Girl power on this team. It's always the guys going down. What a bunch of fuck faces. Give me all that loot. All that loot. Yeah. All right. What is in here? It's Duncan. But I don't want to. 
I wanted to get to Rebel first. So you were the one fighting Darkspawn. I thought I heard combat. You're the elf I found wandering the forest, aren't you? I'm surprised you have recovered. Uh. I would have, had I not been battling them myself. Not all the kills here were yours, as you can see. My name is Duncan, and it's a pleasure to finally meet you. The last time we spoke, you were barely conscious. And there on a Tisha and Duncan of the Grey Wardens. I am Meru, Keeper's Apprentice. And I am Fenerel. You come here alone, you. Killing all those creatures. Yes, I must admit, you took a great deal of pressure off me. Your keeper did not send you after me, did she? I told her I would be in no danger. Uh, we're looking for our brother. So you and your friend Tamlin both entered this cave, and you saw this mirror. I see. That's unfortunate. The Grey Wardens have seen artifacts like this mirror before. It is Tevinter in origin, used for communication. Over time, some of them simply break. They become filled with the same taint as the dark spot. Tamlin's touch must have released it. It's what made you sick. And Tamlin, too, I presume. The dark spawn are drawn to the mirror. You want to lead them to your clan? I do not fear this sickness. The keeper knows how to cure it. She may have weakened it, but she cannot cure it. Your recovery is only temporary. I can sense the sickness in you, and it is spreading. Look inside yourself, and you will see. Confirm it with your keeper later if you like. For now, we must deal with the mirror. It is a danger. Oh, Duncan Smash! That's my boy, Duncan. It is done. Now let's leave this cursed place. I must speak with the keeper immediately regarding your cure. Uh. With the mirror destroyed, I doubt the dark spot. Can we return later and search through the ruins? We could learn from many things here besides the mirror. The cave is not safe. Everything here was exposed to the mirror's taint. If your people must come here, they should cleanse it with fire. What about Tamlin? There is nothing we can do. Let me be very clear. There is nothing you can do for him. He's been tainted for three days now, unaided. Through your keeper's healing arts and your own willpower, you did not die, but Tamlin has no chance. Trust me when I say that he is gone. Now we should return. The dark spawn would have taken it. Why would they take his body? Not to nom nom nom! Dark spawn are evil creatures. And it's best to leave it at that. Sorry. It's not that simple. I would tell you more. I must first speak with your people. I sense no other dark spot here, so it's safe. Lead on. Bring me to your leader, basically is what he's saying. I'm relieved you have returned, and I did not expect to see you again so soon, Duncan. I was not expecting to return so soon either. Very well. 
service for the dead. Follow me, Duncan. I'm eager to hear what you have to say. <laughs> you hear what you have to say about putting things in my mouth, maybe. Swallow hard, bitch. Alright, moving on to my really rude remarks. Um, let's do cunning, strength, there we go. Alright, let's talk to bitches. Yeah, 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 whatever. That's cool. What is over here to talk to? I love these little, like, uh, wagon things the Dalish have. Do do do. Hey Mike, how's it going? Ah, back again. We are all the same clan. His hand is as my hand. I have relinquished nothing. It was my father who first spoke of the beer Tanadon, the three ways of the hunter. The first is the beer Asam, the way of the arrow, to reach for our goal unrelenting. The second is the beer Borasam, the way of the bow, to bend, not to break. The last is the beer at a land, the way of the wood. We are as ancient as the forest. Uh, I miss you too, Mike. Part of the greater land. All Dalish are united in this. One day we shall have a homeland again. Can I get that bow somehow? Never mind. I don't want your bow. Fuck you. Get my own bow. I shove it up your ass. Wait, you two speak? Uh, hello there. I don't think we've met. That's because you're a bitch. Ah, it's good you're well. You weren't here when Paul arrived, were you? I've heard of you. Everyone is talking about you and the other missing hunter. The great warden brought you back here. That obvious, is it? I just found your camp a couple of days ago. A lucky thing. I heard rumors in a nearby human village that a Dalish camp was closed. And I hope to find your hunters in the forest. You were fortunate I didn't shoot you, Paul. I thought you were a shim and abandoned at that. You're not the first city elf to rejoin his people. I'm sure you'll find life among us more satisfying than with the shims, no less harsh. In the alienage, we hear terrible stories about the Hellish. Oh, true, right? I'll do my best. I hope they... Woohoo! I'm training Paul. You'll have to learn how to handle that bow quickly. Yeah, you will. Two hands, four fingers. Do I still play Smite? Uh, on occasion. I haven't updated Mubot in a while, guys. I gotta get on that, I know. And I play Smite every once in a while, but not too often anymore. Yeah, bitch, he's dead. What echo? What are you talking about? She's dead. There's no echo. I thought the 
Shaman's arrival was a bad omen. Perhaps I was wrong. I will see you soon, my dear. Yo. This is Dragon Age. Why do you still have clothes on? Oh, wait. Are you my aunt? Oh, fuck. I made a mistake. God damn me and my really bad jokes. Well, that hat... I don't know why you're doing that. That's uh must be something on your part. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Oh, my God. Everyone's so mean to Ubat. Mubot needs to be changed a little bit. Where's, um, Meryl? What's this way? Meryl back here somewhere? No. Alright, fine. Sup, brah? How's it going? Well, they're elves. All elves have face paint and tree hugging and shit. So do the dwarves, though. Humans don't. Of course. We've no body to return to the soil. But we shall still sing the town. The creators must come to guide him to the beyond. Tell the keeper it shall be done before the clan is ready to move on. You know, it's imperative now more than ever to pass on what we know to the young. Let us tell these children of all of the dales. You can honor me by sharing your telling. Sure. Help me as I go along. Children, hear of the fall of the dales. Hear the tale of what makes you Dalish. Would you care to begin, Galen? Slaves to a terrible empire, the humans built on the darkest magic. When it fell, we became free. Yeah, we did. The Deventer. A homeland in the Dales, worshipping the creators and rebuilding the culture and history we lost in our long years of slavery. They were resentful because we would not worship their gods. And because we put our people first, over the years, their nations grew cold toward the Dales. Yep. In their eyes, we were blasphemers and cruel tyrants. And so the Dales fell. They took our lands and dispersed our people, forcing us to live in their cities and abandon our gods. But many of us refused to relinquish our ways. We instead chose to scatter to the winds, wandering the lands. To survive and preserve our culture, the clans stay apart until the day the Elvenon have a once more. We are the Dalish. No problem. Of the lost floor, walk to the lonely path. Bunch of emo fucks. And the oath of the Dales perfectly. I will let you get on with your business now. Of course. May the gods guide your path. Yeah, 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 whatever. 
Guide my path, blah, 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 blah. All right. Now what do I do? Duncan, my boy. Hold up. One moment. Is Meryl around to talk to you yet? Can I hit up Meryl? Meryl, my girl. How's it going? Let's have fun. You cunt! Welcome back, Oman. Only found by joining the Grey Wardens as sole protectors against the Darkspawn. We're granted some immunity to the taint, but this is not charity. We enlist only the worthy, and you have certainly proven yourself. Should you join, it's unlikely you'll ever be able to return. Dun dun dun. A great army of Darkspawn gathers in the south. A new blight. The land. We cannot outrun the storm. Long ago, the Dalish agreed to aid the Grey Wardens against a blight should that day arrive. You must honor that agreement. It breaks my heart to send you away. As it would to watch you die slowly from this sickness. This is your duty and your salvation. Salvation. I welcome you to the Order. I love Duncan. They have always served with distinction. I know you'll do your clan proud, Valen. Take this ring. It is your heritage and will protect you against the darkness to come. A valuable gift. So, are you ready to go? Of course. Say your farewells. Then let us be off. We have much ground to cover. All right. Before the creators guide you from us, let your clan embrace you one last. Oh, ho, ho. get on that booty! Sorry, I'm a terrible person. It's okay, Omen. Don't worry about it, man. I like. I'll get viewers in time. It's fine. The Deventer Imperium built Ostagar long ago to prevent the Vitals from invading the Northern Lowlands. It's fitting we make our stand here, even if we face a different foe within that forest. The King's forces have clashed with the Darkspawn several times. Here is where the bulk of the Horde will show itself. There are only a few Grey Wardens within Ferelden at the moment, but all of us are here. This blight must be stopped, here and now. If it spreads to the north, Ferelden will fall. Ho oh there, Duncan. King Kayla. I didn't expect a... A royal welcome? I was beginning to worry you'd miss all the fun. Not if I could help it. Then I'll have the mighty Duncan at my side in battle after all. Glorious. The other wardens told me you'd found a promising recruit. I take it this is she? Allow me to introduce you, Your Majesty. There's no need to be so formal, Duncan. We'll be shedding blood together after all. Oh, there, friend. Might I know your name? Pleased to meet you. The Grey Wardens are desperate to bolster their numbers, and I, for one, am glad to help them. You are Danish, are you not? I hear your people possess remarkable skill and honor. Yes, we do. To be fair, your people can be a bit stand. But I blame them, of course. I tell you this, you are very welcome here. The Grey 
Grey Wardens will benefit greatly with you amongst them. Yes, they better. I'm to cut this short, but I should return to my tent. Logain waits eagerly to bore me with his strategies. Your uncle sends his greetings and reminds you that Redcliffe forces could be here in less than a week. Ha! <laughs> Eamon just wants in on the glory. We've won three battles against these monsters, and tomorrow should be no different. I'm not even sure this is a true blight. There are plenty of darkspawn on the field, but alas, we see no sign of an archdemon. Disappointed, Your Majesty. I'd hoped for a war like in the tales. You know, a king riding with the fabled Grey Wardens against a tainted god. But I suppose this will have to do. No, I must go before Logan sends out a search party. Farewell, Grey Wardens. And that is King Kalen. You don't need to know much about him. What the king said Besides is his true. king. They won several battles against the dark spawn here. Despite the victory so far, the dark spawn board grows larger with each passing day. By now they look to outnumber us. I know there is an arch demon behind this. I cannot ask the king to act solely on my feelings. Yes, we should proceed with the ritual. Feel free to explore the camp here as you wish. All I ask is that you do not leave it for the time being. There is another Grey Warden in the camp by the name of Alistair. When you're ready, seek him out and tell him it's time to summon the other recruits. Until then, I have business I must attend to. You may find me at the Grey Warden tent on the other side of this bridge, should you need to. Corrupted. All right. Let's head on over and see what we can see. Do do do. Ostigar, huh? I always like to look at this place. Damn straight. Alright, let's have fun. What kind of craziness can I get involved in here, huh? Greetings. King Kalen is not in his tent right now. I suppose I do, but it wouldn't be prudent to discuss the king's business with you. I believe it's with the Grey Wardens in camp drinking. He holds them in high regard, you know, as his father did. As you wish. Alright, so let's go up here. They're dumb, dumb, and dumb. Don't worry about them. This is supposed to be the battle that sends these dark spawn back underground. Do you believe that? I don't know what to believe. We've won every battle for this. All right. You approach the tent of town logging and state your business. Inside, but I don't think it's my place to discuss his activity. I want to know what he's doing. I suppose as long as we talk quietly. He and the king have been arguing for days. Oh no. The town's known the king since he was swallowed as a bed stand on ceremony. The town speaks his mind, and the king yells right back. Personally, I think the king should do what the town Logan tells him. Without the town, we wouldn't be doing as well here as we are. Don't be absurd. He can't give an audience to everyone who walks up here, you know? Uh, he won't be happy about that. Hold on, I'll go get him. Oh! Psst, lied! I lied to you! Hello, Terry Logan, you fucking fuck! Oh, Duncan's new grey warden, I assume. You dumbass. Kalen's fascination with the wardens goes beyond the ordinary. Are you aware his father brought your order back to Ferelden? Wardens are impressive, but not as relevant as Kalen thinks. I see you're a Danish. Malik, you're a Danish elf once. You saw an equal with the bow before or since. I suppose you'll be riding into the thick of battle with the rest of your fellows, will you? 
here for the glory, you know? Fair enough. Now I must return to my task. Pray that our king proves amenable to wisdom, if you're the praying sort. And yet the fate of the Grey Wardens lies in his hands. Remember that. All right, so that's Taryn Logan. That would be Mr. Duncan. We don't need to talk to him. What else do we got? You there, Elf. What's your name? Uh, it, it, it's Pink, sir. Go tell Taryn Logan that the war party's ready to begin scouting. We'll send word if we find anything amiss. Yes, sir. Right, right away, sir. My respects to Pink. Leave all my preparation. Mike is breath, not for Elf. What do you want? Excuse me, bitch. I fucking hate you already. Oh, I bet. May you sent to distinguish us from our enemies. The blood of battle can confuse them. So we paint ourselves with Cadiz, which overpowers the blood, and also paint our hounds so they know we are the same. Why? Would you steal our Cadiz and give it to the Darkspawn Lords? Kill you if you tried. Even if you succeeded, the monsters would only offer death as your reward. My thanks. There is something to be done, but I'll not be kept from it. I don't like this guy. I hate you. Die in a pit. What do you need, buddy, old pal? My body were held. He's only died in the last battle. I unswallowed dark's poor blood. I have medicine for my help. I need him muscle first. I'll give it a shot. Hi, doggy. Kill the dog. No! Well done. Now I can treat the dog properly. Come to think of it, you get better into the works every time soon. Uh. Yeah. There's a particular herb I could use to improve the dog's chances. It's a flower that grows in the swamps here, if I remember. It's a Mabari Warhound. You shut your mouth. He's adorable. Yes, treat our poor friend, poor little guy. Give him a kiss on his nose for me. Ugh. Shut up with your heathenist fucking music. Come Shut your mouth, whore! Whore! Alright, who are you? Oh, it's Wynn! Hello, beautiful. Those hips. Look at those hips. It's like my wife's hips. Damn. Pleased to meet you, Wynn. And good luck to you on the battlefield. To us all, in fact. Not precisely. The Grey Wardens will be on the front lines, not the mages. Still, we have our parts to play. To defeat the Darkspawn, we have to work together. It's not an idea everyone seems able to grasp. Stragglers, yes. Not the best horde the scouts speak of. I wonder, how much do you know of the connection between Darkspawn that is funny, which has happened in chat. Anytime your spirit leaves your earthly body, whether it's to dream or to die, it passes into the realm we call the fade. It's home to many spirits, some benevolent, others far less so. At the heart 
I'm not staring at the hips, I promise. Some say the Black City was once the seat of the mage. When the mages from the Tevinter Imperium found a way into the city, it was tainted with their sin. That taint transformed those men, turning them into twisted reflections of their own hearts. And the Maker cast them back to the Earth, where they became the first dark spawns. At least, that's what the Chant of Light says. It may be allegory meant to teach us that our own is human suffering, or it may be true. It is as good an explanation as any for now. Yes, occasionally it's wise to contemplate one's actions, but I'm certain Duncan has more for you to do than talk to me. No. Shut up! No one wants to hear your Andraste bullshit, woman. Fucking murder you. Oh, oh. Oh, I got turned down by the cute blonde, huh? It's okay. I gave it to her like an hour ago, so. You're gonna have sloppy ninths. You're the only guy she turned down in the whole camp. Get right, kid. What the fuck? What? Oh, uh, you're the one who arrived with the Grey Warden. I, uh, please forgive my rudeness. There are so many elves running about, and I've been waiting for them. I've simply been so hectic. Uh, I never thought. But please, pardon my terrible manners. I, uh, I'm just the caller master, a simple man. No one special. Damn straight. Yes, of course, you're very right. Did you come for some supplies, perhaps? Let me know what you'd like. We'll look at that later. Probably not. Allow me to put it this way. Do you know why those with magical talent are feared? Those with magical talent attract demons and spirits. We can be possessed easily and thus become horrors known as abominations. Even those with minor talents attract hungry spirits. Anyone with the power of our blood magic from these demons. Hence, we are considered dangerous. This is our curse. Thus, I was made tranquil, stripped of emotions and towered. I am no longer dangerous. So you're just a husk, basically. Our forehead is branded with magic, which still is our talent and mind. The process is irreversible as far as I am. It might seem such to you, but I feel no horror. I am content to serve in my role. You do? I feel nothing. As the name suggests, my existence is quite peaceful. I am alive, productive, and no danger to anyone. Surely that is not a terrible thing. Perhaps we may speak of something else. Do you need assistance? Now nah, I'm gonna go. Adios, bitch. I'm gonna steal out of this chest. Yeah. Purple wispy thing behind the guy? A fucking tent.
What's up here? Shut your mouth, you whore! Shut up. Let me talk to you. Uh, I do not worship your gods, human. If you're not, he crushes your home and kills. It's true. That's what you do, bitch. Get on my level, scub. I bet. Aside from his wounds, we're not sure. His blood is untainted. He's just terrified. Don't blame him. You, you can feel it, can't you? They take the land, turn it black and sick. Oh, you can feel it inside. They'll come out of that forest and spread. Spread? Feeling inside and swallowing? What? Okay. <laughs> Serve it. Yeah, girl. We can do whatever we want. You put your mind to it. Or your ass. Sure, once closer. The what? You want to get whipped? Uh, I can, I can do that for you. Do 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 do. Hello. Desires is of no concern to me. I am busy helping the Grey Wardens by the King's orders, I might add. Should I have asked her to write a note? Tell her I will not be harassed in this manner. Yes, I was harassing you by delivering a message. Precisely. Your glibness does you no credit. Exactly. Here I thought we were getting along so well. I was even going to name one of my children after you. The Grumpy One. Oh, damn. Enough. I will speak to the woman if I must. Get out of my way. Excuse me, bitch. I cock slap everyone at this base. Oh, Alistair. You are not the first. Wait, we haven't met, have we? Nope. I don't suppose you happen to be another maid. And that makes you Duncan's new recruit, I suppose. Glad to meet you. As the junior member of the order, I'll be accompanying you when you prepare to join me. Right, that was the name. You know, it just occurred to me that there have never been many women in the Grey Wardens. I wonder why. They turn into bards, typically. Would that be so terrible? Not that I'm some Julian Letcher. Or <laughs> so I'm curious. Have you ever... Oh, I hate Alistair with a passion. But she does not. I've only fought them once up close. And that was before the battles here started, which Duncan has kept me out of so far. Tell me, did you find them as monstrous as I did? I almost shit myself. It will be at an advantage then. Most new recruits have never even seen you dance before. Anyhow, whenever you're ready, let's get back to Duncan. I imagine he's eager to get things started. 
with the mage. The circle is here at the king's request, and the chantry doesn't like that one bit. They just love letting mages know how unwelcome they are, which puts me in a bit of an awkward position. I was once a Templar. Not that that's all Templars do, but yes, the Chantry raised me until Duncan recruited me six months ago. I'm sure the revered mother meant it as an insult, sending me into the messenger, and the mage picked right up on that. I never would have agreed to deliver it, but Duncan says we're all to cooperate and get along. Probably not. Uh, what about the other recruits? No. Keep an eye out. Maybe we'll see one of them. Let's go. Any questions? Let me know. Otherwise, lead on. I don't remember seeing Sir Jory. That's right. You are going to be aggressive. Good job, Alistair. All right. I didn't see Sir Jory or the other fuck stick anywhere. I don't remember where they would be. Let's look for a moment, shall we? Templars are over here. These are Templars, for those of you who haven't played the game. I hate them, because I like mages, so. I don't see Sir Jory anywhere. Fuck it. Whatever. They're off praying somewhere, probably. Oh well. Duncan! Assuming, of course, that you're quite finished riling up mages, Alistair. What can I say? The revered mother Ambrose. The way she wields the guilt makes it stick all the other. She forced you to sass the maids, did she? We cannot afford to antagonize anyone, Alistair. We don't need to give anyone more ammunition against us. I apologize. I'll go collect her with this. Yeah, because I couldn't find them. This is Sir Jory, a knight from Redcliffe. How do you do? And this here is Davos, a fellow from Denver. Charmed, my lady. And this, of course, is the recruit that Duncan said he was bringing. Now then, since you're all here, we can begin. You four will be heading into the Kokari Wilds to perform two tasks. The first is to obtain three vials of dark spawn blood, one for each recruit. For the joining itself. I'll explain more once you've returned. If you weren't recruited out of charity, all three of your skill and resources... Why, thank you. Alistair is the most junior member of our order, and will accompany you as is tradition. But do not worry. I doubt you will need to go far into the wilds to find what you see. There was once a free warden archive in the wilds, abandoned long ago no longer afford to maintain such remote outposts. It has recently come to our attention that some scrolls have been left behind, magically sealed to protect them. Alistair, I want you to retrieve these scrolls if you can. What kind of scrolls are they? Treaties, if you're curious. Promises of support made to the Grey Wardens long ago. They were once considered maladies, with so many having forgotten their commitments to us. I suspect it may be a good idea to What if they're longer there? Well, the scrolls may have been destroyed or even stolen, though the seal's magic should have protected them. Only a grey warden can break such a seal. I don't understand. Why leave such things in a ruin that's so valuable? It was assumed that they would someday return. A great many things were assumed that have not held true. No, but the effort must be made. I have every confidence you are up to the task. All right. Be an overgrown ruin by now, but the sealed chest should remain intact. Alistair will guide you to the area you need to search. Cut. Watch 
over your charges, Alistair. Return quickly and safely. We will. And may the Mako watch over your path. I will see you when you return. Ah. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I think that's going to be it for today. Next time, we will go into the Kuraki Wilds, or I can't exactly the Kurakari Wilds, whatever the name of it is, I always forget and fuck it up. But uh, next time, when we return, we'll go in there, and uh, we'll see what happens. I know what happens. You probably don't know what happens, but uh, I do. Anyways, guys, until next time, I'm Pete Chappie. Uh... If you want to watch this again, it'll be up on my YouTube channel later today. Until then, though, have a great day, and I will see you all tomorrow where we play... I'm not sure yet. Uh, I'm, I'm honestly not sure what I'm playing tomorrow yet. We'll go up with something. Something gets played tomorrow. Have a great day. I will see you all then. Goodbye.